Why are you recording? What's up guys? Welcome to the vlog. Before we jump into the video and start working on these cars, mainly the FRS, there's a few things I want to say to you guys. So number one, huge shout out to everyone, all my subscribers. You guys are the most supportive, most loving, most caring subscribers that any freaking YouTuber, any channel in the world has. So thank you guys, love all you. Really appreciate all the support you have shown me in the last few months. With both these builds going on, there's a lot going on. There's been a lot of changes made with this FRS behind me. There's a ton of stuff to come with the Evo. So I just really wanted to say thank you to all my subscribers. You guys are so supportive and I'm so, so happy that I've got to share this with all my subscribers, all my supporters. You guys are like a family to me and it's just, it's awesome. Thank you guys, once again, this is just the beginning. I know there's a huge, huge bright future for the channel. I can see it, I can feel it. It's gonna be insane what we're gonna, what we're gonna do on the channel. And honestly, you guys are all here from the beginning. This is still a very small channel and I see huge potential for it. So you guys are the best. Like I would not be here without she already said it. All right, let's get to work on some cars. So what we're gonna be doing on this FRS behind me, don't mind the lift kit, it's all aired up right now. I need to do a quick alignment on it. Just get this toe straightened out because I added a bunch more camera up front. You guys know if you saw yesterday's video. So I gotta get that alignment done. How I'm gonna do that is with just string. I've already made a few videos, so I'm just gonna time lapse it today. So what I'm doing right now guys is just checking my camber and I actually have this app on my phone it's called pocket pit so all you need to do you can either use, just use this on the edge of your wheel or what I like to do is actually use a straight edge on my wheel so I'm running 5.2 degrees camber on the front this app is called pocket pit and they have a camera gauge right on here it's super sick guys I highly suggest downloading it it's free and like I said you can either just use it on the edge of your wheel like this so you can go up to random people's cars measure them if you want Pretty sick. So the car's all done. Now I just gotta figure out how to get this grill to stay on this bumper because I know this thing's gonna fall off the second I drive it. A bunch of my clips on the back side are broken off. Or not a bunch, there's a few. But for some reason, this thing just does not want to stay on this car, on this bumper. I'm gonna do some quick little zip tying action. See if I can get this grill to stay on. All right, I'm gonna give that a shot. I guess if this grill falls off, then it's just not meant to be. And either I can build a custom grill or I'm still thinking about doing a BRZ front end. One of my buddies has a BRZ front end and he's actually doing a 2018 Fernand. So I'm thinking about picking up his uh, 2013 BRZ Fernand. Let me know in the comments below, what do you guys think about the BRZ Fernand? I wanna get some feedback. I always love your guys' feedback. All right guys, let's go on the first drive since this thing's been aired out. I guess it's not the first drive. The first drive I destroyed my bags. But let's go on the first drive now that it's all aligned, everything's good to go, my right height set. Let's go. So the car is driving super well. I am not surprised though. I spent so much time trying to get this alignment 100% perfect. The thing with aligning a bad car is obviously you have to align it at the right height. And then say if you air up a little bit higher, it's gonna throw your toe off a little bit, which is gonna make it drive kind of funny. So it's always kind of a, a hit and miss. But with, with the uh, 3 p system, it always hits height pretty well, uh, my right height. I noticed with the V2, it, shut up, you stupid freaking seatbelt shine. I'm gonna get that fixed with these Brahms and you can't run the, the seatbelt wiring so the seatbelt chime's always going off. But, what was I saying? Oh, with the V2 I noticed that it would never really hit red height right away. So it always be got, kind of driving funny. This car is pretty much driving like it goes on coilovers. It is a little softer because I have my dampening adjuster set all the way soft right now, which I really like. It's gonna be nice for the road trip down to California. Nice soft, gushy ride on the way down there. Right in, right in luxury style of this FRS for now. But yeah, I'm gonna go drive it a little bit more and then maybe I'll take it to Spokane later on, which is the big city close to me. I live way north of Spokane, so maybe 
Maybe I'll take it to town later on and drive around, make sure everything's good to go. I want to drive it at least a few times before we take it on a 1600 mile one way. That's just one way road trip. I think it was 1600 miles. It's a long freaking drive either way. Total is going to be about, it's going to be over 3000 miles for sure. And that's just insane to say because I literally just got this car done. Um, I haven't even taken it on a 100 mile road trip yet. And we're taking it on a over 3000 mile total road trip. That is just freaking absolutely mind blowing. That's, that's when you know you have faith and trust in yourself is when you do that kind of shit. That's kind of like the for build with the RX-7. That's kind of what he did with the uh, with its Rocket Blade RX-7. It's pretty insane. Shout out to Beast for Build though. I like, really like that channel. Pretty sick channel. If you guys haven't seen it, I would highly suggest to go check it out. I'm pretty sure he's kind of local to me. It's like Oregon area. Maybe we'll hit a collab someday. That'd be pretty awesome. Bobby has, I don't think she has a clue that I'm bagging this car. Bobby is my girlfriend, by the way. She knows I'm bagging the car because we're taking it to California freaking real soon. But I don't think she knows that the car is like done, drivable, and... I'm pretty sure she might be coming over today. She wants to film some stuff for her YouTube channel. Actually, what I'll do is I'm gonna have it like aired up a little bit, like how it used to be when it was on coilovers. And then she's gonna come in the shop and I'll air it out through my iPhone or something. And it'll be freaking funny. And I wanna see her reaction. She might go, what the hell is going on here? I just called my girlfriend, told her to come over and that I needed some help with some things. So she's on her way over. She'll be here in about 10 minutes and let's go see her reaction when she sees FRS air out. It's gonna be freaking awesome. So I got the car aired up to about what it was before when it was on coilovers. I'm gonna go chill in this chair over here with my iPhone and air this thing out when she pulls up and we can see her reaction. It should be a good one. <laughs> you like me in your chair? Oh. Is it sick? What are you doing? Just chilling. What are you doing? Um, I don't know what the heck. It's recording. Okay. <laughs> uh, why are you recording? <laughs> you think you're so cool. You had to go. Not that cool, and he didn't surprise me. What the heck? <laughs> mm. Babe. Why? Do, you don't like it? No, I freaking love it. It looks so good. Is it sick? It's sick. Raise it back up. How high? Is that high? Oh. Is that high enough? You can go monster truck in this thing. Uh. Why is it so much louder than You're not supposed to see that I was filming though, so well, you were I mean, the video. Well, I mean, it's kind of obvious. The camera's literally right there. Yeah. Would, you like to, would you like to peep the trunk setup? Sure. Not right here? Not right here. Oh. Ooh. Sick. Yeah, that's dope. It looks really good. Oh, my back seat's down. It is. It looks really clean, like... Ow. You guys monk your head? <laughs> yeah, I turned up pretty good. And that's where my controller is. Oh, that's way next. What are you doing? <laughs> are we doing anything cool later today? Maybe. Okay, well, if I end it here, then I end it here. If I pick it up later, I'll see you guys then. What up, guys? Right now, I'm headed to a car meet by myself. Bobby, unfortunately, had to work. So I just went and washed the FRS, got it all cleaned up. Totally forgot to put my fender vent back on, the Intec, Intec fender vent. It fell off the other day, and I did put it back on. There she is all down there. Nice and cleaned up. This meet's supposed to be pretty big. It's like a two-day event. There's drifting, drag racing, car show going on. So let's go to the meet and I'll show you guys some dope cars. What? It's your car? Pictures out there? Yeah, man. Nice to meet you, Devin. Nice to meet you. Good to meet you, bro. And I gave him Clean clean. Is that a V1? Rock bunny? Yeah. Dope. Legit? Yeah, I don't think so. Hey, it's a look good, man. Let's go. 
Sarge about to go on some two steps. See how it sounds. What's my camera up, bro? Yo, it says negative one. It Cause says you're on a hill. Oh, Look at my front though. It's way more camera out. Oh yeah. Yeah. Fit my life, bro. Fit it as fuck. Fit it. Mine. I have no clue. I think I'm like negative. Seven. You're like negative. You're like positive. Five. But we're on a hill though. Yeah, you tripped me. Negative three. What? Seven? What? That, that, that ain't negative three. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> we're on a hill. We're on a hill. Hey, check it. We need to be not on a hill. Check this side. Fucking Peter Ho. Oh, I meant tech over here. Bro, negative six. 6.3, yeah. That sounds about right. Good enough, bro. Yeah, good enough. You have more beer. Hey. Double fist in. You got, you got $14 beers? Hey, yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> Taping some, some bills on your car. Just being classy about race yeah. cars. That's sick. Four best work in progress is Me, you, bro. Number 14. Oh, it's Dookie. I actually won something for once in my life. Good job, bro. Look at that shit. It's heavy as Good fuck. Dog. Austin asked you one best JDM with his on his oh, XX cars. Hey, fuck you. Car show was pretty sick overall, but I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up the vlog right here. Really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, subscribe button right up in the corner up there. Go ahead and smash it. I'll see you guys tomorrow.